Ginger's post. Real Vaki one. Reclaim your accounts. This is a complete instruction package that I have created, with forms and phone numbers. If any of you have the questions or need help, I am here for all of you. Here is the latest I have found this weekend, and have discussed, and sent to Tank. Here they are below. 1. This is the new prepaid credit card. HTTPS colon slash slash www dot federal reserve dot gov slash publications slash files slash government prepaid report 201707 pdf 2. This is the way to get access to the large funds held with your social security account. Private side solutions dot com slash the SSN master account and DTC information. So, in order to be clear, steps to take to access social security master accounts. 1. Redeem birth certificate. 2. File UCC and state of birth and in one of the three redemption states. 3. Post your bond with Treasury. 4. Once you receive confirmation, green card, from Treasury, bond is activated. 5. Apply for CUSIP number through www.cusip.com. 6. Open up commercial account, and TDA account. 7. Apply for DTC, or Depository Trust Company, registration, obtain counsel. 8. Bond becomes live again on stock market. 9. Pull down funds from TDA through pass-through account. 10. Start paying debts. 11. You can never walk into a bank and get cash from this commercial account. You may only pay bills. Once Transfer Bank receives funds, they will immediately issue a MT762 block this account. This MT760 cannot be monetized. Only debt payments. 3. HTTP colon slash slash www.cusip.com This is the link to find your CUSIP number as you have not found yours on your social security card or birth certificates. 4. Calculate the value of your paper savings bonds. HTTPS colon slash slash www.treasurydirect.gov slash bc slash sbc price 5 locations america's first federal credit union https colon slash slash www.amfirst.org slash locations bessemer 2131 19th street north bessemer alabama 35020 phone 205 424 8542 fax 205 325 3989 monday thursday nine o'clock this will be the master universal number it is america's first federal credit union and the routing code is 262 million eighty three thousand eight hundred eighty one this number comes right off the social security administration from locations and banks to use, they will tell you it's a Federal Reserve Bank, but the Social Security Administration is not federal, or the pseudo use of the word, in any way. Make sure you make this clear to PayPal and Amazon, when you try to make this your primary account. Believe me I am creating a game called the PayPal game. If you get through the matrix, you get a prize. I guess I am there, I can write e checks, and have a world master card, I even got a letter from PayPal, I may be the most responsible customer they ever had, I think I am up to 16 phone calls, over 12 hours, and had to go up 4 levels in reps to get this done, but, whatever I had to do, to get real people real money, I did it. This is what I have been working on this weekend, along with a volunteer list from every state, 
of volunteers in case they are needed to work the hospitals, welfare systems, and meals on wheels, and other critical services like grocery stores, and gas stations. I have almost 400 people ready to help from all over the country, and the world. We are organizing teams in every state, whether they are needed or not, to be sure that no one is left behind. Thanks, Ginger. Below is the complete instruction list, but this information changes every single day. I report what I find with the latest information every day. Complete instruction list. Family. This is a sample copy of the steps to take to access your Treasury Direct Gov account. I call them the TDA accounts. Keep in mind this is a long process. You must take ownership of your accounts and follow through by being persistent. The process to get Amazon and PayPal accounts set up is extensive, but after September 15, 2017, all ACH payments, automated clearinghouse will be effective for all. I believe complete and precise instructions will be made available. But I have taken the steps and tried to make them easy to understand instructions for all. This ACH system is a brand new system, and you must remember, they do not know who you are, so you must send off identity documents, your IDs, so they know who you are. It is time consuming, but once completely finished the results are amazing. Do not get discouraged it's a process, I find. If I was stuck, I would call the people back, and I stayed very persistent to make this work. The faster we all do the steps, the faster this will be up and running, for all of us. Steps to follow. 1. Gather your identity documents, which are your birth certificate, long form, your driver's license, social security card, as well as your passport. These are your identity documents. You are required to have two of these identity documents, but I explained, if you do not have them, you may use a utility bill, or cable bill, that is for your home. 2. What you are trying to do, when accessing your routing codes to use for the banks, is to figure out which region you belong to, which there are 12 total in the US, you may find your region through this link, the Fed. Federal Reserve Banks, https colon slash slash www.federalreserve.gov slash about thief slash federal dash reserve dash system dot htm 3. What you are looking for when you go to search for the routing code that is for you is a less our bank that links up with your federal bank region bank that was established in step 2. I do this, by looking at the chart of the US bank locations, http, colon slash slash, www.sbanklocations.com. The most convenient online tool to find and review banks in the United States, nearly 7,000 banks with more than, US bank locations. 4. You want the routing codes to match these criteria, ACH payments, and Fedwire payments, and the routing code, will begin with the same number that is the first number on your social security card, front of card, in other words, mine starts with a 4, so my number would be a 04 number, that offers ACH and Fed services, 5. This is a sample chart that contains numbers that may work for you. They match all the criteria in step 4, except you must call telecheck to get the routing codes verified. If you do this next step, it can save reversals and lots of time. 6. Call telecheck services. The phone number is 800-366-2425. Telecheck services, Incorporated. 7. When you speak to Telecheck, tell them you would like to verify your accounts, to make sure they work. They will go check the routing code and the account, 
and they come back and see no holds or declines on your account. This means this is a good account number, so I asked if they could send me a copy of the verification, and I was told it would take 30 days, and I said that is fine. 8. Now you are ready to tackle the big beasts of Amazon and PayPal, because you know that your accounts are verified, and this gives you leverage with both Amazon and PayPal. So I went to AOCH site, and made sure all entries were correct, and changed all phone numbers and addresses, and pulled off old credit cards that were expired. Then once I was done I began with adding my TDA accounts onto the respective websites. I went to my account, on AOCH site, and went into the payment options. At the very bottom, you will see it a bank account. This is actually an e-check, or an ACH, routing payment that you are adding to your account. I carefully checked the numbers that I entered into the verified routing codes, as the routing code, and entered my social security card number on front. That is the account number. If they ask, it is a business account, as this is the business of your name. 9. Once all the payment options are added and set, it will prompt you that two small deposits have been added to the account, and two enter the amounts listed off the ledger. You cannot do this step, as you cannot see the ledger, so the best way to do this is to call AOCH service, Amazon, 1-888-280-4331. 10. Tell the clerk at Amazon that you cannot see the ledger, as this account is a private trust, and you do not see the ledger. They will tell you, they cannot see the ledger for 7 business days. Mark on a calendar, the day to call them back. Do the same steps for PayPal 1-888-221-1161. 12. Same process for PayPal. Mark down on the calendar, when to call them back. 13. Once you get verified, ask PayPal about the credit card and check services, because they have pre-approved World Master Cards for each American citizen. 14. Open your mind, and begin to think of all the services you can now use with your accounts. 15. I have found trading platforms and merchant accounts, as well as social security credit unions. 16. You can call any vendors that offer e-check systems, and a routing code over the phone, until the master cards arrive and then we will all be set. 17. The master cards are the reward for completing your PayPal accounts, as there is a prepaid master card issued for all of us. Through the Community Capital Bank for PayPal, you will still have to go through PayPal, even if you do not have a PayPal account as this MasterCard has a pre-approved code in it, and until I finished having my PayPal set up properly, the code would not have been included in my application. I expect to see my World MasterCard within 5 days. Source, Real Truth Universe.